Hi, welcome to my channel and welcome to Mama Bonadonna. So today I want to show you three ways you can use ground meat without bread. It's for people that come to, let's say if they're coming over for barbecue or something and they don't eat bread and you don't want them to feel left out. So we're going to start with the balls here, the little ones that look like meatballs. So we're going to take these two meatballs here. Then we're going to take onion. Then we're going to take the cheese. I'm going to cut the cheese. And then I have some tomatoes and pickles. So what we start is we take mm. the stick. We poke a hole gentle that you don't want the meatball to crack. See? Slowly. Then after we put the onion. Like that. Don't forget you can put whatever you want. Then we're going to open the cheese. Then we're going to cut the cheese in two. Some people prefer to put the cheese on top of the meatball, but I like it on top of the onion. Then we take a pickle. Well, we'll start with the tomato. Then we take a tomato and we put it like that. Mm. Then we take a meatball. A pickle. Oh, sorry, a, a pickle. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> then for the final, we're going to take a piece of lettuce. We're going to fold it and put it like that. So this is what you and what this is what it looks like. So we're going to put it on the table at the plate. Oh my god, today I can't even speak. A bit of mustard cuz some people like to dip it. Oopsie, toopsie. I didn't do it. You weird. <laughs> oopsie, oopsie. Okay, that didn't even make noise. <laughs> okay. Then we can put some mini corn and some olives in case if they want to put some olives okay well I'm not gonna to put too much on a plate cuz can't eat all this so this is the first plate so sample one okay so the next one will be the hamburger wrap so we take a lettuce we take the hamburger we put it in here oops sorry Okay, then we take a slice of cheese. We're going to use the cheese that I cut because there's no point of me opening another one. Okay, so we're going to wrap it and put it in there here. Then we're going to put some guacamole. If I can open it. Yeah. Guacamole. Then we spread it a bit. It's actually guacamole. Okay. It's with a G. Then some onions. I dip this one. Tomato. And voila. We can put uh, ketchup. So what do you prefer if you're going to have it? Ketchup, mustard, what do you uh, want? Or leave it? Leave it. Just add more guac. Okay, so we're going to add a little bit of guacamole. Okay. Then what we're going to do is we're going to... Okay, so then we're going to go like this. Oops. What? Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> I washed my hands. Don't worry. Then we're going to go like this. Like that. Like that. La da, and voila, baby! A hamburger made with a lettuce bun. Yes. Mm. Then I'm gonna show you at the end after I finish the third sample, the third. Um, okay, how it's gonna look? Everything. Yeah, so we're gonna just poke a poke a stick like that, that it stays. Okay. Okay. So the last one. We're going to put the ground meat inside. Oh, is this the salad taco? Yeah. So we're going to put the ground meat inside. This one here, you have to be careful because it could flip over. You don't want it to fall. Onions. Mm -hmm. Tomatoes. Some cheese. And voila. So this one, put it here. So we're going to take this. I'm going to push this a little bit for a minute. So I'm serving this with a bit of cauliflower. So what I'm going to do is I have some bacon, Caesar bacon. So I'm just going to put a little bit. Maybe they want to dip their um, vegetable in it. If it comes out. Oh my God. Oops, oopsie, oopsie. I didn't do it. Are you sure? 
Okay, so that, there you go. And I'm going to put some guacamole on the side, just in case they want to put it in their um, lettuce boat there. I call it a boat. I call it a taco. Okay, so I'm going to show you how they look. So we're going to move this here. So this is the, the first. They're just little samples, you know, if people are coming over and, you know, you don't know what to do with the ground meat because they don't eat bread or, you know, fun for kids or something. So, uh, well, I wouldn't do it. Just be careful with the toothpicks for the kids there. Okay, so this is it. So, enjoy doing it. It's for barbecue. My hair's a little messy. Don't mind. Um, I like it. Like... I guess like it doesn't really make me miss the bread. It tastes still good, you know. Okay, well, don't forget to subscribe and like and thank you for watching. Bye.